Now we'll review uh, visualization and frequent data operations uh, in the notebook. So we'll give you some examples to get started with. And we'll add to these uh, as we come um, to newer problems and use cases uh, in the upcoming weeks as well. Uh, for the visualization, um, I need to explain a quick something on Matplotlib before uh, you see it uh, in the next week. Matplotlib is a plotting library for Python, and Pandas leverages uh, Matplotlib underneath for its plots. So if you want Jupyter to plot the graphs inside the notebooks, uh, we'll have to tell Jupyter to plot inline, uh, as we see here. So notice the percentage sign before the matplotlib in this notebook. This is a simple symbol for a special class of functions in Jupyter called magic functions. So we'll simply here, before we go through matplotlib as a library, um, review uh, or use matplotlib as an inline function. So here, uh, the first thing I'd like to do um, to get our data frame object in pandas, in this case, ratings is our data frame object. And we'll use the histogram function um, to plot uh, the rating column of um, data frame ratings. Um, you can adjust the figure size um, using the command here, so you want how big your figure to look. Uh, and there are many other options for controlling uh, the bin size and uh, other things. Uh, so you can see these all in the documentation uh, for data visualizations in Python using pandas. Um, so let's go ahead and execute this. So what we've done again is we took the ratings column from the rating column from the ratings data frame and provided that column name to histogram function as an input. And we also use the fig size option to adjust that uh, graph size. I'm running this, and we'll see that um, a histogram was generated uh, using this. And now we'll use a similar thing with histogram, similar code with histogram, but this time uh, we'll generate box plots. Pandas makes actually generating box, box plots really easy. We can get that ratings column uh, uh, data frame and say dot box plot. And as you would remember, to histogram, we would get, we gave column rating as our uh, data, the column that we are plotting, um, and big size in a similar way um, will be 15, 20. Okay, let's check to make sure our code here is correct. And now I'll go ahead and run this. So it's going to work on that a little bit, and we'll see, since we have only one column that we gave as a data set, we'll see a box plot of that data. As you remember, our mean for our um, ratings was about uh, 3.5. Here we see the average and the maximum and the minimum of that distribution nicely shown on this box plot. 0 0.5 and uh, 5 on top. So next uh, we'll start um, exploring some of the data slicing, column slicing techniques that we discussed.